Hello everyone, my name is Suvi Goza, PhD is a scholar in chemical department from PDEU. Today we are discussing on the GC, MS and FID. GC means gas chromatography, mass spectrometer and flame ionization detector. This is the instrumentation is calling the GC, MS and FID. GC is using for, it is a process of separating component from the given sample by using the gases mobile phase. Generally, mobile phase is calling as the, like the solvent. You can which type of solvent you can use it in the sample for se for separating over the sample component by analysis by through the GC. Using the mobile phase means our solvent is generally using the volatile component like that methanol, ethanol, and F10, acetone like that. Now, how to operate this instrument? Let's go. Now this is the gas cylinder, uh, hydrogen, zero air and the nitrogen. Here the carrier gases we can using the nitrogen gases for us. Now we can on the regulator by using the key. Now by using the regulator through we are maintain the pressure between 4 to 6 bar. You can see here, here we are maintaining that. Okay, our pressure in the regulator 4 to 6 bar the all the cylinder gases the pressure flow is between 4 to 6 switch on on the instrument now you can see here the instrument switching our instrument is start up now come to the gases flow this is the gases regulator just push on your so gas is started here the hydrogen zero air nitrogen helium gases are using for the hydrogen the zero air must be required for the flame generated nitrogen helium gases as the carrier gases carrier gases is useful for the transport of the compound sample one place to the another place now this is the inlet part. Inlet part. Here you can see that uh, see that one series. Here we are using the 10 microliter series. This is the sample collecting series. This part is the sample holder. One is the solvent. Which type of solvent you can using? You put it in the A and the B. And this is the wastage, wasted part. So this is a must be required to put it the empty bottles here and solvent now this is the inlet part after that our sample is inlet here in the instrument now is going to in the column part this is our the column in our instrument you can see here the two columns are connected now then then is going to the fid detector part or fid detect, uh, detector and then we are in the signal catcher by using computer system software through they are operating this instrument now this is the sample bottle is called the GC wise its size is 1.5 ml now we are operating this instrument by the software through the software name is the GC now click on it it's start up we are operating by using the software through going to the instrumentation part first going to the, this part this is the injection volume how much we are inject by injection series through 1 microliter this is the inlet washing pump washing uh, 5 time washing pre and the post sample pumping 6 time now then to go to the inlet part you can see the heater pressure flow rate pumping then going to the column part which of the column you connected this is over the column now this is the oven this is the main part of the developing the method so first of all here we are take the one sample so we are opening initially the temperature is the 40 degree and i detected the around the 120 degree celsius we can running that the total running time of our program is the 11 meter then after click on okay okay after that when you have complete the method detector then after go, click on the run you show the name of the file method file you can change this already if you change the name you can change this okay now click on the okay 
given the file name then after click on ok now you can see here see here our program is run first time i given the command to five time pumping by the solvent so the five time pumping in this is the part of the washing of the our injector syringe now after that we are given the command for five time uh, five time take the sample so now take it the five time sample and put in the waste state column so that the finally when complete this process when take the final sample so no any error and no any air coming in the series now after that the six time pumping in the sample so the if the air is coming in the serine to so we remove it now take it and then after fill it in our system after that is the five time washing part of our serine now you can see here now a time starting now we are set at the total 11 meter running program inlet temperature oven temperature 40 degree now we increasing one by one now after the complete the process this type of windows is coming you just save this file name now the our result is generated now you can see here we detect the two peaks one at the retention time 1.606 and one is the 2.542 the 100 percent is our sample is the methanol so you can see here the methanol peak is getting 99.8880 is a pure form we getted and the other some traces uh, traces are detected now in the graph point of view this is the graph is generated in the x axis time he is indicated the retention time and the y axis is the response response time how much is available now this big peak is indicated the other sample component which of the component is available here we are sample using the methanol so the methanol peak is here and the other impurity this is in the methanol sample i don't know which of but here the detector so that i can find out that which of the traces is available in the component